Hello and a very warm welcome. We are at day four of this first test match. We are at the Gaul International Stadium and I can tell you that this test match has reached a very interesting point. Sri Lanka, 312, led by Tananjaya de Silva with 122. Angelo Matthews, 64. Ramesh Mendes with the ball yesterday, toiled hard, 536, but the standout performer with bat in hand was Shaquille with 208. His maiden double hundred in test match cricket. Sri Lanka at the moment trailed by 135 runs. Salman Aliaga, four balls and then we went off for bad light. He's got to complete that over now. First ball, day four. Oh, looking to go through the onside. As he's done there. Short, wide, first boundary of the morning. 18 for none. Straight down she goes into the gap. And let the bowlers know to stay away from there. As quickly as Dimut Karunaratne is on this full and straight delivery. Beautiful. Outside edge, it's gone through the gap and it's going to be four. Oh, well controlled, well controlled, waited for it. He does, but what he's done well today is he's used soft hands. Oh, up is, up is, up is, taken. Aga Salman, the fielder. But he was guilty of not getting to the pitch of the ball and that's why it went up in the air and a very good catch by Salman Ali Aga. The most Karuna Ratne. He scored 20, it's 42 for one. Kusal Mendis. On average in the 40s, closely not 4,000. That's four. That's fine. The Sri Lankan 50 is up. A rare loose delivery on the leg stump. Risky. There's a big shot in the slot and gone. This time for four. Couple of bounces into the boarding hole. Big shot. That's gone. Had to clear the infield, which he did quite cleverly. Ah! Ah! Looks at Jason. Gone. Finger is raised. He strikes goal, and that'll lift him up. He's asking his mate what to do. He feels it's uh, it's a little high. He's gone for a review. Pitching in line, impacts in line. Wickets hitting three reds. We'll get you back on screen, so it's Richard's decision knocked out. The Lankans have uh, lost a review and have lost Mendes as well for 18, 79 for Tuna. It's still extremely good. Angelo Matthews maybe getting on a bit, but his record is phenomenal. Plays it late, drives it beautifully through the offside, and it's well stuck for four. Gets off the mark with a lovely, delicate boundary through the offside. Now that's the frustration. That is the frustration. Goodness, he's very lucky. Very, very lucky. Well, he's come down the wicket here, which is what we've been talking about. But he's gone across the line. And it's not there to hit. You can use your feet, get to the pitch. And if it's a good delivery, you can still play a defensive shot. Oh, taken. Brilliant. Brilliant catch. That is an outstanding catch at slip. Barbara Azam. Angelo Matthews goes. Wow. You don't know how good a catch that is. One, because it's gone quickly. Two, it's gone to his left. Angelo Matthews got runs in the first, not this time. Goes for seven. 91 for three. Dinesh Chandimal didn't have a good outing in the first innings, but uh, he is a determined character, I'll tell you. Plenty of experience. 1400s. Wow. 94 for three. 
for a moment I thought they might get in another over but the umpires thought other, otherwise going into lunch had some very close calls as well but Pakistan will be very pleased with their morning sessions work three important wickets and it's a very good session for Pakistan 312 461 Sri Lanka 94 for three still behind by 55 but Shaheen Shah Afridi has bowled well has decided to come round the stumps after lunch but there we go right in the corridor Shaheen Shah Afridi lovely shot leans into it that's 50 slightly upish but the moment it hit the ground it's better away That was a nice, yes. You keep pegging away, you'll get your reward. He gets another. But he has thrown it away. He has thrown it away. There was no need to do that. Now that was a painstaking innings of 52 from 150, 15 deliveries. Sri Lanka falling, falling quickly. That's the fourth wicket that's fallen, and that's why Dananjay De Silva. He's out there. Tail up, Afridi. Yeah, you're right. That's through, that'll be four. Lots of runs have come towards the third man area. And again to third man. He's trying to invite the batter to drive. That's a boundary to end the over. That's true. Waited on that one and crashed it into the fence. Oh, on the bounce. Baba just a little bit back there in the first slip. He's already taken a blinder. Baba Razam just a little bit deep there. That's up and over, over mid-off. The fielder was in, so he attempted that shot. Well, here's the sweep shot, and it's nicely played away. Didn't hit it with a lot of anger. Great placement. Talk about the sweep shot. This man is very good with the sweep. Counter-attacking cricket. This is so good from Dhananjaya De Silva. Pakistan will have to bat last in this test match. What a hit. Delayed the shimmy out of the crease. And again, even bigger. This time, even further down the pitch. Great batting. In the end, taken. Come on, boy. What a good catch. Dinesh Chandimal stands around. Okay, clearly bit. And then. Okay, okay, looks like the fingers are underneath the ball. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, thank you. I'm ready to make my decision for the big screen. Imam ul -Haq. the ball was dying on him. You see the back of this man, Chandimal, who scored 28. It's 159 for 5. So, Samar Wikrama, average of 29.44, very much in the infancy of his career, just seven matches. Yeah, backed away. Created his own length to be able to hit the ball. Or punch the ball through offside for four runs. <laughs> what a catch! What a catch! For the second time in this test match. He's down the wicket, so it makes it that much more difficult because Abdullah Shafiq is trying to follow him, which is what you should do. He stopped and he's gone back to.
to the right side to take the catch one-handed. That is unbelievable. It's been dismissed for 11. It's 175 for six. 175 for six now. Ramesh Mendes is the one who walks out to the middle. Shot. A bit of room outside the off stump, and he fetched it from the outside into his 19th hole, and clearly you see him tiring a little bit. This was a tired delivery. Half tracker put away for six. A pie served early. There's 12 minutes to tee. Someone needs to tell Abrar. Gets the 50. Lovely, smooth innings. 12.50 and really, he should get a standing ovation. 100 in the first innings, 50 in the second. To hang in there, to score runs, because this game can become about runs. The more runs they get, the more Pakistan will have to work. No, no, no. 61 runs plus Sri Lanka. And it should be T. The bales are off. Three wickets in session one, three in session two. But Dhananjay is like that fortress. There you are. That's the lead. 61 runs, four wickets standing. Doesn't want to chase money. That's in the air, into the gap. Another boundary and 50 partnership between these two. Played it late. The runs are coming in. Oh. That's well played. Now this one has gone slightly wider of the crease. The angle takes the ball down the leg side and he just helps it on its way. Picked up again. Boundary. Ah! Oh, that's got to be out. Surely. And is. I don't think they need to waste a review. Here we go, Rod. Pitching in line. Impacts in line. Wicket's hitting. We'll get you back on screen and you can stay with your original decision of out. Ramesh Mendes, 42. Sri Lanka, 251 for seven. Prabhat Jasuria strides out to the middle. Oh, shot. Nicely done, Prabhat by Jasuria. It's gone for four. I wondered why he wasn't running the last ball. <laughs> Beautifully played into the gap. Probably run away from the two fielders. Four. Oh, that's gone through this time. A straight drive through mid off. And taken, caught behind. Yes! Come on! And Shah, Shaheen Shah Freedy bowled the perfect length. Dunham there, Silva for 82. It's 269 for 8. Hits it over the top, into the gap for four. That's good thinking. Catch will be taken. Pakistan have caught brilliantly. It's an easy one compared to what they've caught. Yeah, Prabhat Surya was pushing his luck. Ten was the contribution, 274 for nine. And gone again. That's it then. For Sri Lanka, Pakistan would need 131 to wrap this up. And Rajita tried to hit the ball very hard, could not control the stroke, but Shan Masood was in control. Took his second catch of the innings. Matt summary then, 131 runs to win, 312 and 461 in Sri Lanka, 279 put up a valiant fight, but 131. They probably test Pakistan, but I think that they should secure this. It's a record that is improving. 
Average of almost 40. Average of almost 46. Best of 160, which he got here. On the leg side, and always a nice feeling that you get off the mark straight away. So he's off the mark with a couple. Oh, very close to the pads, but that's got away from the deep fielder for four. Oh, good use of the feet. Positive shot. In his zone. I think he's, he's Sadira Samaravikrama somehow held on. And he's been given. He's referred it. Okay, thank you. We've got Paul and Bet resolved no gap with the spike. We'll get Rod back on screen. Uh, Rod, we'll get you back on screen. You can stay with your original decision. I'll be out. You're on screen. Signal. Abdullah Shafiq is gone for eight. Pakistan are 16 for one. We want that average to improve under 30 into his 29th game. That was too short. After bowling so many good deliveries, he just drags it down. That's a lovely shot. Once again, the beginning is glorious. Cut shot gets put away to the fence for four. It's a hard ball. It's a new ball. And so there's value for money if you middle one. Oh, taken that shot. Like I think he's gone. He's gone. He's followed him and made it difficult for him to play the stroke that he wanted inside edge. The catch is also very good. Nishan Madushka doesn't miss many under the helmet. And Shan Masood goes for seven. 36 for two. It's Noman Ali who's come in. Straight a line. Put away extremely well, so he'll keep the strike. In fact, Noman Ali struggling to get there and he's done, he's gone. He's got the ball cleanly. Through the stumps, bails off, batch with the ground, ready to make my decision for the big screen. Three down now, Pakistan for 38. Skipper is in. Oh, that's a bad ball. That's runs for Barbaraz and probably four. Just a neat leg glance played. Bales are off, and so Pakistan finish at 48 for three. They need 83 more runs to win. Plenty of action in session three. Seven wickets and 117 runs. So at the end of day four, Pakistan 48 for the loss of three. And need 83 runs to win this test match.